Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, um, in my kitchen, I actually just got back in the house from doing a little grocery shopping. I just cleaned out my whole freezer and my refrigerator. I took out anything that I haven't used in like 30 days. I threw it away because my last video, I made me a banana smoothie and girl, let me tell you, those bananas was bad. I got extremely sick. I started, it was like a food poisoning. Started pooping, number two, number three, number four. I kept vomiting. I was like, I couldn't hold anything down, couldn't hold water down. But that subsided. I actually bought some more bananas and I ate a newer banana like yesterday just to make sure I wasn't tripping. So it was those three bananas that I put in that banana smoothie tore me up. I had stopped at the store, but I'm back and better now. This is like three days later from that happening. Yeah, I'm just starting back getting some groceries, trying to figure out what I'm gonna eat for the week. It's Monday, the holiday. I stopped at the grocery store. I picked up, I went to two, well, three grocery stores. If you wanna say Target, Target do have groceries, but I stopped at my local health food store and picked up a rotisserie chicken. What I'm going to do with this, I'm going to put on some gloves and I'm going to break the chicken down. Uh, like shred it all the way down and put it in my glass bowl. So that way I can make like chicken enchiladas with like these corn. I have some corn tortillas. So I have those and I had bought some minced garlic i haven't had minced garlic in a while so i said let me get some and i had got this can of la victoria red enchilada sauce this is the mouth so i wanted to try that out i never had it so that just gives me options with the chicken oh and i had bought two cans of these dark red kidney beans like okay i was just grabbing random stuff organic bananas or organic mango for like brunch breakfast lunch i grew up eating like the sun made uh raisin bread cinnamon raisin bread that is in a red bag i saw these organic breakfast bread daves these are the raisin raisin the roof no high fructose corn syrup is sweet cinnamon it reminds me of that sun-made bread. So I said, let me try this because I do like cinnamon raisin type breads. I've been geeking for some waffles. So I had got this waffle mix and I found a waffle maker at Target for $13. It was originally $30 and this was the last one. So I'm about to actually open it. Really on the budget. I bought some chicken tenders. These were cheaper than the actual chicken breast, so I had just got a like a family pack of tenders. Got some Chobani Greek yogurt. This could be for breakfast. One salad. I was being so cheap on the budget. I got this salad for a dollar seventy six cents. And my favorite juice. This is the Simply Watermelon Juice. I haven't drunk sodas in like three months, and I tried one of these the other day. These are the Squirt grapefruit sodas these are caffeine free they were so good they really good let me open this waffle maker because i'm about to make me a waffle let's see i never had a waffle maker honestly i wanted the one that you could flip spin but okay i'll upgrade to that one one day Silver and black oyster. Let me check it out. It looks cheap. It looks like a cheap thingamajig. Basically, it's a Belgian waffle maker diamond force non stick coating. So it says the longest lasting non stick. So just white cookie down with coconut oil she was itching after she got a bath she just been itching like crazy so i just wiped her down with some of this organic virgin coconut oil and now she's over there snoring Ooh. 
Good morning, you guys. I just started getting ready. Actually, I went outside and grabbed me some Starbucks. And I had to run back in the house because I had to use the bathroom. So I wasn't far from home. So I said, let me come back in the house. I had on a hat, but I was like, let me do my ponytail a little bit neater. And I add, use my brush. I use my Ajawa leave-in styling conditioner. Leave-in conditioning styler. Why, why can I just read it and say it? But anywho, I put some of that on my ponytail. Now I'm going to use some of this Biomint Protect and Shine Oil Blend. What's today? It's Tuesday. So I could wash my hair today or I could wait to like tomorrow. I'm not trying to wait too long to do my wash my hair. It feels amazing right now, honestly. The ponytail feels so soft, so nourished and everything like that. So I'm going to just put some of that shine oil in my hair. I did my baby hairs. I used this Extreme Pro Expert. This is a real 24-hour extreme control. This has alcohol-free... And it has aloe vera in here. So I use this. I like this for my edges. I haven't used it in a while, actually. Ooh, my stomach curtain. I um, woke up this morning. I ate me a banana. Even though them things made me extremely sick. But I just know I'm not allergic to bananas. Because I used to sneak in the refrigerator at my auntie house and take some banana pudding that she made while everybody was asleep. I used to be the one sneaking the banana pudding. Cause that's the best time to eat it when it's cold, right? She'll make it and we'll get some for dinner, but it'll still be a little bit warm. And I'm just like, man, mm -mm, I like mine's cold. So I was sneak in the middle of the night and get me some banana pudding. I think I'm about to go to iFly. I'm about to take a drive out to Ontario, California. That's probably like a 30 minute drive. Meet up with my friend. And I'm gonna check my PO box. My PO box is out that way too. So I might as well check that before it get too full. It's the day after the holiday. I wanted to work, but it seemed like it's kind of slow. So I'm going to just, you know, go have a little fun if I can. We actually got to go to like this tuxedo place and want to try on tuxedos because he having um, a get together with his family, his father's birthday, and they're supposed to be, you know, wearing black and stuff. So he's trying to dress accordingly. So, you know, he got to take the stylish, profilish person with him. You feel me? I'm not going to be telling him, oh, you look, I did tell him, you look good. Dress her down. He look, you know, so handsome in a suit and tie. So that's what my hair looking like. My eyebrows or whatever. They could be touched up a little bit. And use this revolution. I had ate me, what, one banana. And I had a piece of this organic breakfast bread that I got by the brand Dave's Killer Bread. It was pretty good. I toasted it up. And, oh yeah, I didn't get back to you guys when I made my waffles. I messed up the first batch. Like, I put way too much water in the first batch when I was making them. It said two slash three cup. Why put two cups two whole cups of water in the mix and that just really threw me off right so i just threw away the batter i'm like oh, okay i put it up then i came back to it hours later and put the correct amount of water which was two third cups i put two whole cups of water i'm like why is it so watery so girl my waffles is better than Roscoe's chicken and waffles. Stop playing with me, Charlotte. 
now i'm just like addicted to making waffles honestly i made three of them yesterday because that recipe was full three waffles and i put cinnamon i put vanilla extract i used one egg i used two third cups of water i used one and a half cups of the waffle mix girl now i'm just like call me the waffle queen because i'm about to be making all types of waffles waffles if i can matcha waffles mor moringa powder waffles banana waffles like just healthy waffles stop playing with me i think i'm gonna put some mascara on my bottom lash i haven't been putting a serum on i ain't gonna do too much because i seen these lashes right that it don't require no glue, no magnets, no nothing. It's just like self-adhesive. But I want to try those because the ad look is so good. And I'm thinking I'm going to be looking for some. But I've been loving the Ardell Lightest Air ones too. I don't have one no pants, but this is a graphic tee that says make love, not war. I like cool graphic tees that's like cool and unique. You feel me? I need to make a stop at my favorite store out in Whittier towards LA to find me some more graphic tees because that's where I got this from and people just be like I like that I like I put on um two fragrances today let me show you I put on replica I haven't worn this fragrance in a minute I put on replica bubble bath you see it's still like um it's almost gone and I put on this Kyle Gone, Take Me Away, Hawaiian Ginger. These actually smell pretty good together. And both of them, to me, it's like a nostalgic scent. Like, if I was to smell it, it reminds me of something. Like this, I had it, like, last fall. It, it reminds me of fall weather. This replica bubble bath. So, and this one reminds me of, like, summer. But together, it just is, like, giving you know ending the fall ending the summer welcoming the fall ending the summer welcoming the fall this is exactly what it's giving so that's what i'm wearing today and i really haven't been wearing this that much but i have it and this is like a classic fragrance body spray and i just i love the smell it's just such a nostalgic scent to me like that's what I'm wearing. Ending the summer, starting the fall. You know, it's, today's my mom's birthday. My mom, happy birthday, mom. Soon, I can't wait to take me a little vacation from everything. Like, I just been working, working, working. But I'm grateful God gave me the strength to keep moving and keep going and keep pushing me because I could think, um, right now I'm thinking like, how? Am I right here? Like, how do I still have the energy to do what I'm doing? But, God, oh, faith in God. Keep your faith in God. I'm going to put on, y'all can't see my butt, you know. I actually need to go to Urban Outfitters because you know what I really love from Urban Outfitters is their underwears. <laughs> Yes, I love their underwears. And actually, they stop too. So I do want to make a stop and get me some nice, cute underwears. I'm like, I'm an underwear fanatic as well. I love me some really cute underwears. Oh, did I tell y'all, um, like, my computer is, like, basically done for. So I got to get a whole new computer. And I got to get a new camera, actually. I'm just like... I only have my phone now like how did I just like everything was going good the next thing you know no computer no camera and I'm just filming on my phone editing on my phone and it's just like I was not expecting that to happen to me but you know everything happens for a reason I want to get a 
nicer camera and i want to i'm gonna get the newest macbook 13 pro for now it's just my phone my phone my phone my phone that's going to be washing my hair it's been what a week and like two days since i had my trim and i had a good old wash from my stylist and everything like that and i just been like feeling like the night before christmas on washing my hair because i cannot wait to see what my curl pattern looks like so i'm about to wash my hair i stopped at the store and i stopped at one of my favorite vintage shops out in uh whittier to have some clothes and i had picked up this it's a halter top and i thought it would be perfect for when i'm doing my shower videos and this is like a satin material yes so this would be good for my shower videos and my hair wash and it's really really nice i love that sexy look because this was around only like it was 15 dollars i don't know why but this is a good piece of material and i like it it's like can't wait to put it on and what i found was this cute barbie like gown thingy oh my god it's so freaking cute it has the barbie logo right here it's so cute it is see-through it's really like a sexy barbie on the tag you got barbie on the tag the bottom has like the can y'all see what the bottom look like that's what the bottom look like and this could be like my nightgown it's so cute it's so it's really cute honestly you could wear this like over top of your bathing suit too i just made a few stops today and i was like oh i went looking for some type of medicine like iron medicine but i stopped and looked at the lashes and i saw these lashes they are really cute they have like a nice curl shape to them these are the kiss big personality these are really cute i like these they are so nice like i stack them when i'm putting on my matte lashes and if i want to make them look full and everything like that i just stack them this i picked up today i think i'm gonna use this today you guys i never knew dove had a renewing glow pink uh clay body wash and i smell this it smells so beautiful it's like a luxury scent it smells so good y'all this is the pink clay that's what my hair looks like out there yeah yes let's get this shower started <laughs> Wow, seeing that spoon and that chopstick got me thinking about other things. <laughs> I'm about to start my treatment, but I'm about to mix my serum and the deep conditioner by Aja Wild Beauty together. I'll be using a couple scoops of the deep conditioner and I'll use a couple drop of the blue tansy. This is the strengthen repair serum. So I'm going to just mix that. This is a silver chopstick that I barely use. So i do know how to use chopsticks but these ones i just i just like the wooden ones better it's all mixed up so i'm gonna get my hair wet before i start my shower you guys i have low porosity hair look at my hair i really didn't comb it out that much before the shower so hopefully i don't have many problems with this shower routine slash hair wash so i'm gonna just put my hair under warm water just you know helps loosen up any product in my hair from the week and i'm just going to let this run over my hair for like a couple minutes until it's all saturated before i go in with my shampoo that's a must for me to get my hair 
saturated with water before I shampoo. So yes, um, I will be using the Ajawa Beauty Moisturizing Shampoo. I made my mind up because, you know, I have a, a couple sh moisturizing shampoos right now. So yes, this is my hair. It's feeling it's feeling really good right now, actually. What's happening to me in the dark? Can you tell me what it means? I lay my head on my pillow, staring out the window, trying to stop for a sign. It's the reason why. start my wash i'm using the ajawa this is the moisturizing shampoo this is my first take using this one and so far i love the consistency of this is really moisturizing to the scalp it really gets down and touches and reaches my scalp like what i really want to clean is my scalp only so this really a little goes a long way it's very soft moisturizing and it really cleans the hair it feels really good on my scalp it has like a cooling minty feeling but it's really like cleansing so i'm taking in my uh, scrub brush my scalp cleanser brush just helps me you know do a little extra digging to my scalp so yes this shampoo i like it i give it a eight out of ten so far i like it because it's actually moisturizing it's not making my hair tingle or anything so that's definitely what i need and it's really soft on my hair and i like that it's gentle and yes it smells amazing and i'll be washing my hair one time because i really don't have too much product built up on my hair but it's really good i like it so far <laughs> what i added for my deep conditioner i added these two together the blue tansy line smells so amazing i love that serum before i put the deep conditioner in my hair i'm apply the protect them uh shine oil to my scalp this feels amazing and it's going to give like extra deep conditioning to my hair so i'm putting this on my scalp before i apply my deep conditioner you guys this oil is very soft i really like this oil the whole bio mint uh line smells the same it has that i guess winter is it winter green scent but yes it smells really like refreshing so i'm gonna just go in and apply the deep conditioner towards my ends first and work my way up so i'm gonna just put it on but i'm going to like section my hair off piece by piece and really like get that deep conditioner into my hair on every strand then i'll go in and deep detangle my hair with my demon well this is like a demon brush but it's also called a bass brush so i'm gonna go in and i'm gonna detangle my hair and you guys the deep conditioner feels amazing on my hair. It's on a thicker side, but it's really like it's supposed to, you know, deeply penetrate. So it's really good for low porosity hair. So that's why I like it. And it feels amazing on my hair. <laughs> For the deep conditioner i'll be 
deep conditioning for about 15 minutes. I'm using this cap. This cap is really good, really effective, and I'm going to apply my turban over that. So I'm going to leave it on for like 15, 20 minutes and continue my shower. And I'm rinsing off my brushes, and I got to get that gunk off my brush, rinsing off my back from any type of shampoos or products on my back. I really hate that feeling. So, yes, um... I'm going to start my shower routine, and I'm going to use the Dove Pink Clay Body Wash. First off, this smell is amazing. Like, I'm like, i never seen this. I got that from Ross, if I didn't tell you guys. It smells so good. It's really so soft on my skin, you guys. It suds up really nicely. It has a luxurious sud to it, you guys. And as I'm rinsing it off my skin, it feels... My skin just feels really soft, you guys. This brush isn't like a harsh brush either. It's really a soft brush. So I really like this brush. And it really gets um, everywhere on my body because I do have a long handle. I just took it off the handle because this brush, you could take it off the handle and just hold it in your hand like this. But this Dove is, I really like it. This is like a top dove body wash for me like i don't have a lot of dove body washes but this one is basically a top favorite of mine i love it and it says pink clay i love my pink so yes if you can find this the pink clay body wash it smells amazing i'm out the shower and i still smell it on my body i don't have nothing on no lotion or anything my skin smells beautiful Going in with my Venus Gillette Shave Gel, you guys. This stuff is good if you have sensitive skin. It's a fragrance-free shave gel. I've been using it for almost a year, and I actually had this for almost a year. A little goes a long way, and I use my Venus Shaver as well. This is really good. I just have to, you know, keep replacing the uh, razors, but this one is really good for my sensitive skin. And when my underarms get like stubbly, that's when I like to shave, you guys. This really helps keep the odor of your underarms down as well. And I have a significant change in my underarm odors, you guys. Ever since I detoxed my underarms, it's been smelling so good. Haven't been like any type of must smell or anything. I've just been using my mineral deodorant and my aluminum free deodorants. And I'm just loving that I made that decision, you guys. So I'm shaving just to keep, you know, everything clean and sweat free. Even if you had 3D glasses, man, fishing the bikini, she from 
Calabasas. Got a pocket full of blue cheese and some green relish. I'm a psycho for these hunters, got a cash finish. I've been studying these hunters, I'm a mathematic. And this love make me wanna buy my daddy candy. Since the love got me geared up, I don't need a head. Drake goes, let these niggas know we've already. Spend some calls on my bitches, we ain't ball capping. Alien hit, feel like I'm living on my own planet. Bought a spaceship, now I'm a space cadet. Big white mansion in my habitat. Ain't a lot of stitch like a lady tag. Fuck a rich bitch, have a rich set. Smoke a lot of trees, need a weed plant. Did take a lean where the lean at. Sleeping on these G's, there's a bean bag. I've been going jeans, cause I'm cool right. She know she was overseas, they were pan up. Shop in Tokyo, Japan, they the bands up. Blue pair t shirt, sleeve button up. Hot top, turn the vert, riding anywhere. Ain't got a band down, this ain't a propeller. Man, we just made a dime, cop them Gucci sweaters. There's a dribble niggas drowning, I cannot help them. So I applied the leave-in conditioner to my hair while I soak and wet in the shower. Now I'm going with the moisturizing curl cream. This is a thick formula, so I'm going to take my hair down and apply this in sections. My hair feels so good, looks so good with that leave-in conditioner in my hair, you guys. Do it in the shower while your hair is soaking wet. The benefits are amazing, you guys. So I'm going to just section my hair off and apply this into sections, you guys. I want to make sure every strand is moisturized. And love, you know, TLC, baby. And um, don't go chasing waterfalls, TLC. You feel me? Yes, shout them, shout them out. But my hair feels good, you guys. My what I notice is my hair at the roots is not puffy. So I'm beginning to think that this, these products is really good for my hair. And far as the trim, my hair just feels more elongated as well with the trims. And my hair just feel overall healthier. So that's what I'm noticing once I get all the moisturizer cream throughout my hair my hair just feels really healthy looks really healthy you guys i'm not mad at it i'm just like hold on it's just getting thicker you guys this is the stage where it's going to sprout soon you it's going to be longer so i just don't like that my hair is in this little wash and go state so I'm going to just apply the oil over my hair because we can't do all that and not seal in that moisture with the Biomint Protect and Shine oil. This is a really good oil. I'm going to squeeze that on my hair strands so I really won't just, you know, be keep on stressing my curls out. My hair looks good. It feels good. You see that moisturizer really done sunk into my strands. So that's another sign that this is good for low porosity hair. My hair is just looking really good, you guys. I'm doing my little baby hairs because, yes, I got to do that with this type of stuff. So I'm going to just let my hair air dry, and I'll definitely be back to show you guys my hair dry. Look at my roots. They are flat. They healthy. Look at that hair swinging. My hair is really swinging. So it's we getting somewhere. I can't stop moving my hair. Look, I, I can't stop. I can't stop. I'm happy though. This is the happy dance when wash day was a success. Like, well, that's what we want. That's what we want. A successful, stress free wash day, you guys. And I just really just shampooed and deep conditioned my hair. So, yes, break. I'm taking a yogurt break. So my hair is like 60% dry. It's mostly like dry in the front. So I just wanted to show you guys what it's looking like. It's giving a good curl pattern. Can you see that? I don't want to. I'm going to just let it like air dry. I guess you could say I did a wash and go for my style. It feels really soft. The ones that's like dry. It's more dry towards the ends instead of the root so that's what it's given my hair has never shaped so good like this since you know my hair just shaking good it's shaking shaking good shake 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 hey okay i'm loving the shake that i'm giving the way the curls are just like curling individually 
It has the nice curls and everything. I'm not going to touch it that much. But I just wanted to show you guys what it's going to what it's looking like so far. I'm just sitting letting the air dry. It feels nice and moisturized. So I'm going to just, you know, I don't want none of the curls to get like tangled together. So I'll definitely make sure that once it's fully dried that I like break them up and make sure they're not intertwined. But I just got them here also to show you my hair what it's looking like i'm happy now i got this box and i want to it's this fragrance that i got from sephora and i'm just i'm just really curious on how this scent smell i got the small bottle i just been getting a small bottle first because i've read a lot of reviews on this scent and they was like i had got this small bottle and it smelled amazing but when i had got the big bottle oh no it did not smell good so i'm just like what and look they sent me this big old box and i only ordered one thing like come on now but i do reuse the stuff look this big old box for this one small thing sephora y'all just a wasteful sephora but this is the ellis brooklyn Ellis Brooklyn Myth Auto Perfume. This is the 7.25. Actually, I had got got this one mainly for free, honestly. And that's why I chose to get it in the small bottle because I was curious about the scent. Can y'all see that? I was curious about the scent. So the reviews was like they had got the small one. The small one was smelling great, which made them get the bigger one. But when they got the bigger one, it was just like, oh, no, 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 no. It comes in this nice black packaging. I'm not trying to really tear the box open. I'm trying to, like, pull it open. Is this a spray or a dropper? Oh, my God. It's a freaking dropper. I do not like dropper bottles. I do not like it. So I guess I'll just dab it. I really wanted to spray. Why does it smell like I already have something like this? It really smells like I already have something like this. Come on now. It's giving a musk. That's why... I definitely want to try it because i'm a musk person i love musk anything with musk in it smells like something i already have yep wow it smells like this clean soft laundry to me that's crazy oh my god it smells exactly like this clean soft laundry that i already have and I know I'm not really, yeah, it smells just, come on now. They smell very similar. If you have this clean, classic soft laundry, compare it to this and tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Because now, see, I'm glad I didn't buy, the, you know, a bigger bottle. The dab of do honestly. I have a similar scent. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. But I thought this was going to actually be the spray bottle. Wow. Anywho, I'm not mad that I got it, actually. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. But my hair is... Yes. Stop playing with me. My hair looking good is... Y'all know my right side is still on the shorter side, but hey, eventually it's going to be caught up. It's going to be caught up. But I hope you guys enjoyed this wash day routine. My hair feels amazing. That product by Ajawa Beauty, that combination. I use the shampoo, the deep conditioner. I use the tansy beauty uh treatment serum i added that to the deep conditioner and i used the um Arjawa shine 
and protect oil for my scalp my scalp felt amazing you guys with the deep conditioner i felt like a cooling tingling sensation while the deep conditioner was in i really like that deep conditioner it did so good just in the 15 minutes that i had it on with the cap the deep conditioning cap then i put the uh cat and turban over that cap and the deep condition did wonderful when i rinsed it out my hair felt silky soft nourish and everything and once my hair was still wet that's when i went in with my leave-in conditioner and i just my hair loves when it's soaking wet and i put applied the leave-in conditioner in it baby and then i added the curl defining cream that's what's in my hair now i can feel that it's giving just like a i say a light hold because this little hold is definitely going to break the cast probably like the second day third day and then i applied the protect and shine oil over that to seal in all the moisture but yes we're going to see as the days go by i'm going to show you my hair and see how it's acting i don't know if i'm gonna leave my hair like this but i might leave it like this if it stay put because just doing washing goes for me it really like causes single strand knots and i try to stay away from any type of style that's going to give me those knots so long as they stay in place or whatever they look real they're going to just be looking better and better and better you guys know that i just got my trim and yeah by my trim is really making my curls look way better than before and it's still 60 percent dry my roots is really wet so Hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you on the next one.